consistent. Or he may right. Oh, crap, that's right. Or he may needs to get powers. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, cheese, cheese roll. Was that her name? I don't know. All these side characters are pointless. They don't come back. This, what, what, what the hell is that? I don't remember this at all. I mean, I know how she gets her powers because she needs like. She needs to like protect her friends or something stupid like that. It's basically, she wins because power of friendship or something stupid like that. I remember that much, but I don't know. I never really liked Orihime that much because she was hella timid. Yo, home dude, you passed back that. <laughs> wow, the shit just came and pushed the hell out of that guy. I was about to say, this man looks like a pedophile, but the shit just came out and just pushed him right in the face. That was hilarious. Totsky, Totsky, that's right. Totsky's. I don't know. Totsky's fine. She's not a main character or anything. She's just sort of there. She's whatever. Don't they develop some sort of powers? <laughs> wow, they just got cheap. Look at that pedophile looking dude back in, back there. Look at his ass. Don't, doesn't Totsky get some kind of powers too? I don't remember. Totsky don't matter. She does nothing. What I like about Bleach is that there's like a variety of characters, but most of them don't do anything. I mean, you kind of compare Bleach to uh, One Piece, where every single side character matters in some way, even if it's a little way. But um, you look at Bleach and just like most of the side characters, they're kind of useless. Like all the lieutenants in the Soul Society, they're freaking useless. They don't do anything. But uh, I mean, I don't know. That's mostly due to like power scaling and stuff. If you want like a good series with uh, power scaling and stuff like that, uh, honestly, One Piece isn't bad. It's just long as hell with us like 40 billion episodes. What? That's your whole ability? Which is a weak ass punch? It's not even a punch. It's not even a slap. What kind of weak shit is this? Get the hell out of here. You saw that? The dude was just like, eh. What kind of weak crap is this? You're supposed to be freaking zombies. Like, and you don't even buy people. What kind of crap is this? Useless ass zombies. Even more dumbass zombies, right? Alright, um. See, look at them. One attack from, uh, what's her face, and she's almost dead. And they're almost dead, sorry. Let me guess, you do poison, don't you? Stupid, curly haired bastard. Hey, well, you see silence, so that's great. <laughs> I'm a bitch slap you with my hair. <laughs> These stupid ass dumbass hollows. Hollows aren't really interesting characters until you get to the Aronkar arc. Or, uh, they're some of the best characters. But until then, uh, they just suck. Like, they don't really do much. And even those, they're, they aren't really technically full hollows. They're sort of soul reapers. They're sort of hollows with soul reaper powers. Because, uh. Yo, I think I just saw a rap. Um, uh, what was I saying? All right, there's like, uh, hollows with like soul reaper powers because I stuff happens to them. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> this freaking hollow just like, murdered the hell out of our image. just like, been slapping her with hair. <laughs> That's hilarious. Also, um, home chick is like charmed or whatever. So that's not good. Can can somebody else like charm? Honestly, if anybody, I think Ron Geek would be able to charm like all the dudes, even some of the chicks. So why isn't she charming people? <laughs> if you get what I'm talking about, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Um, come on, dudes, why are we dying? Yo, this hair attack is just like killing. Yeah, Chad. Brr. I mean, it looks cool, but it, like, does nothing. <laughs> Look at that. Like, the, the dude's health is, like, not going down at all. <sighs> Can you just die, dude? Like, seriously. What's up with all these hollows having, like, crazy amounts of defense, dude? Like, what the hell? Are my dudes hella weak? Or is their defense hella strong? Like. Oh, yeah, she develops her, like, weird-ass powers that she never uses. 
or he may like she, she all she does most of the time is just like oh let me put up a shield like it they could heal people i mean she has an attack uh function sort of but she like never used it because uh, it sort of sucks she like fights with these weird fairy things in her hair yeah see she puts up a shield and that shield could heal people Yeah, yeah, yeah. She fights with, like, these dumbass fairy things. It's whatever. Orihime sucks. After uh, the injuries, Orihime and Chad got whisked away by Kisuke. Urahara. Uh, Urahara, that dude is dope. Look at that hat. Hat is dope. Um... Also, do you think, like, Urahara and Yorichi were kind of a thing? Because, uh, I'm pretty sure they had a thing. Because, uh, but that's just speculation on my part. Yorichi is, uh, this cat thing. <laughs> it's gonna confuse the hell out of people that haven't seen Bleach. <laughs> Where's the mustache, bro, by the way? Same time, Ichigo runs to the park. Yo, what's up, Ori uh, Rukia? What you doing, fam? Number three, that's it? That's all you've been doing throughout this whole time, Ichigo? You suck. Did you find Yuzu and Karin? Nah. Yeah, I don't care. Where's Ichigo's dad during all this, by the way? I don't remember. Because <laughs> freaking Ichigo's freaking sister is just, just running down the street for no reason, but I don't know. You want to do this for so long? Yeah, whatever. Ichigo's dad is like really important, especially later on. I don't want to spoil anything, which is proving to be kind of difficult since I've been spoiling a whole bunch of crap. But uh, he is kind of important. What's up, Uryu? You dick. You started all this. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, you know. Although I find it kind of weird that Uryu can't freaking tell that uh, Rukia is the Soul Reaper. <laughs> I don't know. Who are you? Or you is like a very complicated character, which is kind of uh, kind of a strength because of kind of what happens in the last two arcs of Bleach, that being the Fullbringer and the Thousand Year Blood War arcs. I think kind of plays up to his strength, but uh, you know whatever. Ichigo almost kills him like twice, I think. Or you, please let me kill you so we can be done with this nonsense. Um, so, uh, yeah. If you're wondering about Uryu's dad, uh, th that man's kind of a dick. <laughs> like, I don't want to be insensitive or anything, but, uh, that man sucks. He's kind of like a cold, distant type of dad because Uryu's mom died and blah, blah, blah. Uryu's mom's death is also kind of a spoiler. <laughs> Although it's remarkably similar to what happened to Ichigo's mom. But, uh, uh, no spoilers. Who are you? You asshole. Oh, 200 years ago. Oh, yeah, that's right. That stupid ass captain. What's his face? The creepy ass one. Yeah, he killed, like, all the Quincy. Because, uh, he, that's his idea of fun. Wait, 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 Mayuri? Yeah, Mayuri Kuratsuchi. Yeah, that guy, um, the guy was being uh, a dick. But, uh, we're, we're, we're gonna get there. I'm pretty sure we're gonna get there. That was a pretty famous scene from uh, the anime when Uryu fought uh, Mayuri Kuratsuchi. Also, how long does the game go for? Because, like, um, are they gonna go throughout what happened in the anime all the way through? Because, uh, that's... That's kind of a long time, because the Bleach anime has like 300 like episodes or something like that, which is a lot. Oh, hey, what do you know? It's uh, your boy Aizen. Um, damn, my voice is hoarse. How long have I been doing this? What time is it? Damn, now I'm parched as hell. Um, uh, anyways, what was I talking about? I don't even remember. Yeah, Rangiku kicks ass. 
Uh, look at Chad. He's hella buff. He has a buff ass arm. Uh. Um, I just can't wait until we get to the Soul Society because uh, when we get to the Soul Society, that's when stuff starts uh, ramped up quickly. Um, why are we fighting? What are these? Freaking scorpions or some crap? What the hell is this? I don't care. Kalos were always kind of whatever, honestly. Why attack on Giku? Attack like Chad. <laughs> Cause Chad sucks. <laughs> I mean, even in this game, he's like hella slow. Oh, hey, what do you know? Hey, hey. Or he mates your brother. He's back from the dead, sort of, into being another version of dead. <laughs> Wait, didn't, like, Ichigo send him to, like, heaven or something stupid like that? <laughs> Hell yeah, Chad, you're hella buff. <laughs> Did? Did he send him to heaven? <laughs> what happens to Hollow when they die? Because I'm pretty sure they either eat each other or... Soul Reaper send them to like Soul Society or some stupid like that. Ah, whatever. Yeah, so in case you guys don't know, um, hollows eat hollows to become stronger because that's a thing that happens. Like, uh, especially like the strongest ones, it just means that like they eat most of the dudes, like their friends and stuff. Because that's kind of what happened to Grimjow. If you don't know who Grimjow is, uh, he's a. Uh, He's like one of the best characters in Bleach. <laughs> of course, sorry, he may needs to be freaking dazed. Ruka gave you suck. I wonder if they'll make like Rukia like be hella badass like when she gets to like Soul Society or something. Because uh, well, not Soul Society. Um. Uh, the Aronka arc because she does have some dope ass moves she likes to use ice in case you guys didn't know her and uh, Toshiro uh, right that's the guy's name they like using ice for some reason but uh, I think Toshiro is better at because you know he gets summoned dragons and crap like that or he may all she does is like eh, ice sword whatever and that's it basically it's not really all that grand Oh, what do you know? The freaking chat died. Oh well. Keep harping on Chad, but Chad, Chad's a Chad. Chad, uh, Chad's a pretty chill dude. Will you freaking die, dude? Like we ain't got time for this. <laughs> Gotta go fight a big ass Mendel's Grande. How will they do this? I am genuinely like, how? How are each? How is this gonna work? Because the Menos Grande, if I remember correctly, is a uh, big as hell. And like Ichigo slashes him across the face and then he leaves. But like, hello, game. Uh, sorry guys. Um, I don't know what the hell just happened, but like, I don't know. It was weird. Can't reach. What? What the hell are you talking about? Freaking game. What the hell am I supposed? All right. What, uh, what the hell? What the game's bugging? I don't know what the hell that was. My bad. I don't know. Well, it seems to be working now, but like for, for like a second there, it was just like bugged out or whatever. Whatever. Um, what exactly happens to Oreo in the Thousand Year Blood War arc? I don't really remember. I remember her being like a traitor or something like that, but other than that, not much. Oh hey, what do you know? It's it's freaking the uh, Wario's backstory. My grandpa died because he sucked. <laughs> yeah. Although Wario was kind of a dumbass, because his grandpa was just like, "Hey, get a get along with Soul Reapers. Like we could like live in harmony or whatever." But then Wario was just like, "Nah, fam, I'm gonna kill him." Because you know he's stupid. Kind of like Sasuke. Hmm. <laughs> parallels. Because uh, if you don't know Sasuke, uh, he found out that Itachi like killed his 
entire family and stuff like that because of uh on because of this other thing and then uh, he was like sasuke protect the village be a good boy but sasuke was just like nah fam i'm a rebel i'm gonna kill them all for no particular reason because uh, sasuke is a bit of a bitch even though he is like hell overpowered him and naruto like imagine if sasuke got like the nine tails that would be hella over i mean he that kind of does at the end of the you know whatever i'm not even gonna but you yo dudes when's the menos grande gonna show up because uh that's kind of what i'm waiting for because uh, that scene was actually kind of dope menos grande why are you homie don't load. <laughs> Yo, we, we, we gonna fight his cankles? <laughs> this is gonna be freaking hilarious. We're gonna fight his cankles. Hey, what do you know? All the homies showed up. Yo, like, Urahara, like, pull out your weird cane sword thing. Oh, you could kill it. I believe in you. You could summon that weird ass lady that fixes you or whatever. Whatever his bonka is. Urahara's bonka is, like, it's weird. It's hella weird. I don't. I don't even know how to describe what the hell it does. But um, it like it like lets him like change things on a molecular level, which is kind of overpowered. I'm not gonna lie, but it's it's really weird. Um, so you guys want to tell me how we're gonna fight this big ass metal grande before it like murders me? Uh, okay. I mean. Um, <laughs> yo, please show me this man. I was ground. I really want to see. Are we gonna just fight his cankles? Because that would be like way kind of hilarious. We straight up gonna go God of War on this. Just fight the thing in stages. I should play God of War on here, on uh, YouTube. Although God of War, like, we are gonna fight his cankles. Hell yeah. I'm sorry. Yo, freaking, yo, chill, dude. First thing he did was fire a Cero right at my face. What kind of nonsense is this? Oh, yeah, by the way, guys, uh, I sort of got Renji off screen. I forgot to tell you. I traded in Rukia for him because uh, Rukia sucks. Uh, how did I get Renji? <laughs> I did some other stuff. I was, like, doing, like, summoning people. And then somehow, out of the blue, I just got Renji. And uh, I love Renji a lot more than I like Rukia, I'm not gonna lie. Even though Renji also kind of does uh, basically nothing. Another one? Is you serious? Yo, am I dead? I mean, will you died? Cause... And Chad died. Alright, dope. So that's something. Yo, if this man is Grande, he's gonna fire off another Cero. Uh, we's dead. Oh, no, he didn't. Alright, dope, we won. If you were fired off of like another Saro, that's a dunce. But uh, thankfully, we can like scratch his cankles and then he's gonna fall down and die. <laughs> How did they beat the Menos Grande? Cause uh, homeboy is big as hell. Um, how, do, how do they beat him? I don't know. I don't remember. Also, it's kind of a shame that Ichigo never gets a bow. Because, uh, oh, spoilery reasons. Uh, but I just thought I should say that, like, it's kind of a shame that he never used the bow. He's just like, nope, bows are for bitches. I'm going to get this sword. Yo, look at look at how dope that is. Look at that effect. It's like distorting space-time. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, I'm, I'm talking about this arrow. Oh, yeah, that's right. Freaky Ichigo just blocked the Sarah with his fucking dumbass sword. Um, yeah. Ichigo, if you don't know, is the most overpowered character ever. <laughs> if I list off like all of his powers, like he's the most overpowered character ever, but he he only uses one move. <laughs> I mean, he still wins with that one move, but it's still hella hilarious. Yeah, we're gonna give him a little love bite. Like, come on. 
Fight back, bitch. Yeah. So you guys gotta understand that uh, Ichigo, like, uh, slashing, like, Amano's Grande was, like, a big deal back then. I mean, you have Orohara and then this, like, the dude with the cool mustache there, and they could have easily, like, beaten up the Menos Grande. But at this time, like, only captains were known to, like, take care of Menos Grande or whatever. And here's Ichigo just, like, doing it, like, casually and stuff. So, um, he might be special. Mm, I don't know. Mm. But, yeah. What, uh, what the hell are you doing? Y'all Yo, gonna hug? Hug it out? You're happy that you killed the Meadows Ronde or something? Let me make sure this is <laughs> Yeah, okay. Okay, now who now would use kind of acting like Vegeta. Okay. Ooh, forgive me, Grandpa. I have been so stupid because I am. If only you weren't so weak and didn't die or whatever. Freaking Oreo. Please forgive me, grandfather. Yeah, yeah, we know, dude. We know. Also, why the hell didn't Oryu's dad train Oryu? What his grandpa have to do it? I'll tell you why, because uh, Oryu's dad is a bit of a dick. Okay, dude, guys, I've been talking for 40 minutes. I am tired. So, uh, thank you for watching, and uh, goodbye.